And it is 20 minutes after 8 o'clock. And joining us in studio this morning from uh, Tobosa Los Pasitos and Little Steps and, and the whole part of uh, Tobosa Developmental Services, Nicole Dean back with us. And then uh, our, I guess, uh, would it be director? What's the official director of uh, the Little Steps mm-hmm. Learning Center? Uh, Marisa uh, Mesa as well. Good morning, Marisa. How are you doing today? Good morning. Good. How are you? Good. It's uh, Thanks for coming on the show. Thank you for having us. So you must have an a, a enormous amount of patience. Because I know the little steps, it's a it's a daycare center. It's mm-hmm. dealing with little kids and 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 they got seventeen thousand percent more energy than you do. <laughs> <laughs> and uh and I, I know you guys do a great job over there of you know creating programs and 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 offering, you know, not just babysitting, but actual structured things for these kids and all of that. And I, I know. It takes an amount of patience to just have so. You're probably a very patient person, I'm guessing. Yes, I, I love the little ones. So Good, it awesome. Comes easy. I like them too, but uh, after a certain point, I'm like, I need to break here, you know, <laughs> just to whew, quiet. But anyway, um, we, we, we really want to remind folks that uh, bring the family out, uh, come out this uh, weekend. Uh, Los Pasitos and everything's having their big stepping out for children carnival. It's going to be this Saturday, uh, day after tomorrow. From 9 a.m. to noon, and it's going to be at the Debosa campus, um, which is a 110 East Summit. If you if you're not familiar, um, but yeah, yeah, kind of give the it's just a big carnival. Come out, yeah. and have fun and games and stuff for the family, food, you know, prizes, the just the whole gamut. Yeah, everything's free. We're gonna have a great raffle. We have some amazing prizes. Everything is free. Just come. Yeah, have a good time. Absolutely, it's a call it a, a pre fair fun. Yeah, you know, if you're going out, you know, that way you can come out, ride some rides, and hey, maybe. Maybe there'll be some games that are also at this carnival that you'll find at the fair, and then you could like play like pool shark on them <laughs> and like get all your skills and practice and here at this carnival right. it's free. Yeah. And then you go hustle them out at the fair yeah. when they like I bet you can't get the hoops on the rings like oh yeah bling bling you're like throwing them blindfolded and trick shot and choo and then they land right there you know get all your practice in at, at the at the stepping out event yep. here and then then you go make your big prizes and you walk around the big bears and whatnot <laughs> at the fair next week so <laughs> I'm training go away <laughs> but uh, yeah it's it's a, and again it's a family fun family uh, bring the whole family out kids of all ages from from infants to, to 37-year-old kids, bring them on out and come have some fun with us here. Yep. Now, obviously, if you want, if, if you and your family are looking to learn more about the resources available through not just Los Pasitos and Little Steps, but really all of Tobosa in general, um, they're going to have folks on hand at the event. They can help you. They can te- the, learn more. If you, even if you want to learn more about the job coaching adult side, there are going to be people on hand that can that can help you uh, get that information, get that process going. But uh, but really, the the event is all just for fun. Come out, uh, learn. You know, come out and just have fun, play games, and um, and just love to let you see uh, see what 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 Tobosa and Los Pasitos and everything's all about, and and see what this program is. Mm -hmm. Um, Obviously, for folks that don't know, I probably should have started there before we just started talking about carnivals. (laughs) Um, The Los Tobosa, we all know, and I think we talk about the, you know, what they do for adults, children. Um, Los Pasitos, which is a a, a part of Tobosa here, they are the early intervention uh, for, for children, a lot of medically stuff. So, um, science has got to a point where we're, we're able to detect and uh, treat many childhood developmental issues that um, rather than waiting till they're like four or school age before they start addressing some of these things, now they can do it uh, at like six months at a baby, infant level. And uh, that's what Los Pasitas is all about for helping kids up to, what, three years old, I yes. think, right? Uh, free of charge, by the way. Uh, helping families deal with, like, if your child's dealing with, uh, like, on the spectrum stuff, dyslexia, hearing issues, um, you name it. any of those kind of developmental eyesight issues, um, Los Pasitos helps get that stuff taken care of now. So by the time they get school age, they really aren't behind in the curve there. They're they're ready to flow with, with the, the rest of the herd there, so to speak. And that's that's kind of, in a nutshell, what Los Pasitos does. Absolutely. And then, of course, Little Steps, that's, that's a, it's, it's, I say, traditional daycare, but also on steroids. It's so, <laughs> it, it's, 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 yeah, it's like your daycare center, but you guys have so much curriculum and everything. Mm-hmm. So it's, it's almost, 
I say school like, but people hear school. What do you mean school? No, 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 not like you know pens and papers and you know essays and all that. But just you know curriculum where they're learning, where they're where they're starting to get those skills uh, that that will come in uh, handy as they get older and start learning other things and all that. And that's what it's all about. Am I pretty close to there? Yeah. I'll um, let you t- tell folks about that. You're kind of. I think you know better than I do. <laughs> Uh, well, Little Steps Learning Center is an uh, early childhood um, learning center. Mm-hmm. Um, we serve children from 1 to 12-year-old. Okay. So, um, and like you said, it's a, like a structured play-based sure. um, center where the children learn through play. Mm-hmm. And, um, you know, we just support families and uh, Little Steps accepts also um, the child care assistance. So, oh, okay. So um, if you need help uh, financially and everything, you guys it, it, you do accept all the financial aids and help yes. and and probably could even help fill out some paperwork oh, and document yes. mm-hmm. and if you're not familiar with that stuff and and uh your staff can can help them navigate through all yep. that stuff too. um it kind of got um the the early i mean the child care assistance um centers had gotten closed a little bit for covid and stuff so a lot of it had to be done electronically okay so we we have all the applications on hand and we help the families submit their applications okay. and send them and and so, all that. So we kind of help them uh, go through the process. But now they're opening up a little bit more. So now okay. the families can go in. Come and visit and mm-hmm. see the on-site and see yes. the facilities. Mm-hmm. and Which I would imagine, if you come out to the carnival this weekend and everything, are, are you guys doing some tours and things like that we, for folks? We're not opening the doors. Not opening the doors. Keeping it all outsourced. Gotcha. Okay. All outdoors, but, but you can make an appointment or absolutely. something like that. We can make that happening and, and all that kind of stuff. But, yeah, I forget COVID world. We got yeah. <laughs> things we take for granted we can't do. But we will, yeah, we'll have information at our welcome mm-hmm. table yeah. with all of our brochures and things like that. Yeah, mm-hmm. absolutely. So, uh so again, again, come on out. It's uh, actually the third annual uh, yes. Los Pasitos Stepping Out for Children Carnival. It's happening this Saturday, the 2nd, uh, from 9 a.m. until noon. Uh, it is a come and go. Come so and if go. you can't quite get there till 9.30 or 10, no big deal. We are serving lunch at 11. So okay, so if you want to get on the lunch, yeah. be there at 11. Uh, you guys doing like hot dogs yeah. or something? Sweet. Absolutely. Free hot dog lunch. And, of course, everything about the event on Saturday is completely free. doesn't cost one dime. Come on out, bring the whole family, play some games, have, you know, have some fun, talk to, win some prizes, eat some food, and uh, who knows? And then uh, maybe you get to learn some information and get some uh, opportunities to basically plan the future for your family here with mm-hmm. with through some of the services available through Los Pasitos and and Little Steps and and to Tobosa here. So. Mm-hmm. Um, can, can, if we don't mind, talk a little bit about like what what you guys have on the horizon here with stuff and plan. Like at Little Steps, what's like? Uh, I mean, do you guys work on curriculum and things. I mean, now that you're kind of opening back up, does it <laughs> give you guys a chance to kind of do more and and, um, and do things that are more like what you're expecting to do at, at Little Steps? Yes, um, we go through a uh, focus, and mm-hmm. it's a New Mexico curriculum. Okay. So um, we, our teachers um, are trained and everything through focus. Okay. And so they are, um, they have certificates and stuff through focus. So, okay. And then um, we are able to start going to, on our field trips, like how we usually do. Cause oh, we, good. We Which really... is something you really don't get with daycare, generally oh, no. speaking. So <laughs> yeah. this is this is part of that thing where we're saying little steps is that that on steroids part I yeah. was talking <laughs> yeah. about. We uh, love taking our kids out into the community. Good and, deal. Um, we used to take them out to like the library a lot, the zoo. Um, we should be able to go back to the library yeah. now, and uh, mm-hmm. zoo's getting back up. So the, yeah, these yeah. trips will be be able to happen again. Yes, this summer was lots of fun. Our after school program goes all out. They go somewhere like every single day. Good. And um, they take three large out of town trips. So oh, nice. The after school teachers and kids were super happy that they were able to get back. To okay, so they get trip to Redoso or in the mm-hmm. mountains, something like that, or yes. some, some place that looks different than here. Yes. Yeah, cool. And so um, the the parents give permission, and then um, the teachers are allowed to take them. We just we had to follow all the uh, COVID safety. Sure, you know, we had to wear our masks. You guys follow all the practices and, like and that, so. protocols and procedures mm-hmm. and hoops and all that. Yes, in order for the kids to go out, they they had to follow all those rules and sure. they they did really well so good. and they are doing good so excellent mm-hmm. well good uh, hopefully uh so it, it, again come out on saturday you can learn more about enrollment and all that mm-hmm. and 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 that process but yeah. but um that's 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 where i think what's great about little steps and things like that i know we have 
people and they do their home cares and and it, you know there, there's some great stuff to all I'm not gonna but but to get children exposed to the things they need so that they can progress and mature and learn um, it's so integral and I think that's where little steps comes in because you need that social interaction especially in the world of COVID where we're at where it got mitigated really bad for the last two years yes. so I imagine there's going to be kids that are two, three, they're kind of behind the curve a little bit because they didn't get some of these opportunities. Uh, and so now we got to play catch up a little bit with some yeah. of these younger folks. So a thing like Little Steps can really get you ahead of that game. Is when I mean, Whether you're trying to get your child back to that level on your own, let's let's incorporate the team at, at, at Tobosa mm-hmm. to let us help you do that. And uh, that's what Little Steps is all about. That's what Los Pasitos is all about. To be honest, that's what the whole Tobosa Developmental Services is all about. Mm-hmm. So come learn more. Come out and be a part of it. Take a field trip. I, I, so I got to ask, like, uh, if you, like, as the director, and I, I'm not holding you to it, so, to, <laughs> but, like, if you get to pick, like, your dream field trip that, that you could take the kids, um, obviously within reason here, what, where would it be? Uh, the water parks. Nice. Like we loved to, I loved taking the kids because I used to be the three year old teacher. Okay. And um, I enjoyed the the splash pads. Okay. So um, recently they opened up that new one. The new one, yeah, on the south end. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Excuse me. So I was real excited to get the teachers to take them to that new one. Oh, cool. Especially like the two year olds because it's a little bit smaller at mm-hmm. um, Carpenter Park. Yeah. And so that one was really nice. They had lots of fun there. They got to have a picnic and go play. Because um, the kids love playing in the water, so that's lots of fun. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. I, I got to be honest. If I had my druthers and could get away with it, I'd want an adult version of the splash pad. Oh, yeah. Except there'd be lots of lawn chairs and then those things that shoot around. Yes. Maybe some coolers. <laughs> strategically placed. Why can't they make an adult splash pad? <laughs> Kids look like they're having too much fun on that. I want an adult splash (laughs) pad. Let's get that up on a city council agenda here. Adults put it right next to the kids one so the kids can go and have fun and then the adults get their splash pad. All right, so maybe we can. That's a very obtainable thing. I think Mm -hmm. we can maybe. uh, Well, it probably won't be happening till warmer weather uh, happens again because Mm -hmm. splash pad does have open times and I think it's. Uh, I think it's relegated to weekends and stuff now till you know, now the kids are back in school and everything. Mm-hmm. But, but yeah, that's the kind of stuff that, that, that really little steps, those pasitas, it's all part of that too. And, and um, I'm going to jump back and forth here, Nicole, uh, with Los pasitos, as far as that process, it's really just calling and scheduling an appointment to meet Absolutely. with, with your specialist and things and saying, Hey, um, you, you don't have to be referred to by your doctors or anything else it, it, as a parent. If you uh, look at it and you say, I, I just feel like they're behind the curve or something, right. let's have it checked out. And, um, and, the, and, and, that, and you guys will, your staff, everyone, they, they're the experts that work through it. And they'll say, yeah, you, you're right, and we need to get, or, you know what, no, we're, you're right on the ball. Keep going. Right. We're, we're good to go. But either way, you can get that free of charge uh, so you know exactly where you stand on all of that. And I think if you have a child that's, if you're new, especially new parents, new kids, um, Let's get these checked out because that's that's where the science side has come in. These are things that we really didn't know or know how to to, to check, certainly treat at that point. You know, uh, it's like the glasses one's the big one because I I mean I, when we were kids, you never saw you you were in school before you could get glasses. You just run around bumping into things, I guess. Till <laughs> till then, I don't know. But but because of that, now now there's like my my nephew. Uh, he got his first pair of glasses. He's like one, and I'm like, I didn't. I was 30 before I got my. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just it, it's, and they're cool because they're all bendy and can, they don't make those for adults. That's another right. thing I want for adults. Right. Why can't I get blue flexi glasses <laughs> like like the kids have? Why yeah. can't I have that? Those things are durable. They're pretty fashionable. You know, mm-hmm. maybe bigger for my head, but right. but yeah, uh, all of that. And that's Los Pasita. That's where they're learning all that, and that's where they're 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 able to help these kids at that age. So come out come out to the carnival Saturday. Yep. Let's let's play some games and, and 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 eat some food and have some fun here. But then let's talk to the staff and say, you know what, I, I have a I have a eight month old or have some let's 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 find out if we're where we need to be or 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 do we need to get some special uh help here for for our child. And Absolutely. and that's what Los Pasitos does. So mm-hmm. come out this Saturday. And then of course you want to learn more about little steps mm-hmm. and 
if you're tired of uh, harassing grandma about the kids, because I know that fight too. <laughs> I'm taking care of it. You know, if you're done with that argument, go to look. And, and here's the thing. I'm, not, I'm sure grandma's a good babysitter. I'm not going to knock on grandma. <laughs> but grandma ain't taking them to field trips. Grandma, maybe unless it's the grocery store and it's like, you get what I'll get you. You know what I mean? Uh, sorry, I was a kid one. <laughs> Well, now your kids getting structure, curriculum, things, and and, and then at dinner time, what'd you do at at, at 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 little steps today? It's like, oh, we went to the splash pad, we 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 played a game, we uh, met my friend T- Ted over here. We, you know, that's that's mm-hmm. that's the difference. So, um, is there anything else we want to mention? Anything we want to cover? I get on. We are again. offering evaluations at the event. Okay, so if you need, so, so you can get it done, taken care of. Uh, you know, absolutely. If someone's too distracted for for two minutes, send him because it's probably the husband. Go send him <laughs> off to get some funnel cake or something, and then yes. you guys take care of the business you need to handle. <laughs> exactly. It's like, hey, go look at that bird over there, sweetie, and then you go take care <laughs> <Right>. of it. <laughs> <laughs> um. If you want, of course, if you can't uh, make it out to the event on Saturday, but you definitely want to uh, learn more about and, and talk with you guys, um, the website uh, that's got everything is trytobosa.org, T-R-Y-T-O-B-O-S-A.org. There, that's the main website. You'll learn about Little Steps. You'll learn about Los Pasitos. You'll learn about uh, the adult program. You'll learn about everything that's part of it. Um, if Also on Facebook, um, and actually I think Los Pasitos has its own Facebook, if I'm yes. right. Mm-hmm. Uh, Tobosa has its own Facebook, which kind of covers all three. Uh, Little Steps has its mm-hmm. own Facebook as well. So you can follow them individually or, or follow the umbrella of, of them through. But uh, those are the best places to like and follow, stay up to date on, uh, especially if you have a child in Little Steps or whatever, and if there's any updates, changes, things, uh, you know how life is, especially mm-hmm. in covid Things happen. Uh, that's the quickest way to get information for that mm-hmm. kind of yeah. stuff. Employment so. opportunities there too, and try to boast us. So very good. Yeah, mm-hmm. if you're looking to be yeah, a part of the we team, are, we are trying to hire. So uh, uh, is it for all three branches or different? Like, is it adult side? The to- uh, just the Los Pasitos and Little Steps. Okay. Mm-hmm. Excellent. So I, looking for I help. I think on, to, on to both the side too. They, but yeah, there as well. If the world we live in is accurate, yeah, probably. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're always looking for bilingual. Oh, so, very good. So if you're interested in one of our positions, we we would. Love well, if that. you love working with people, if you love uh, interacting and and making impacts, that's mm-hmm. uh, I don't care what what portion of Tobosa you work for, you're going to get that in there. Whether Absolutely. it's working with the adults whether it's working uh, with the developmental uh, issue side through Los Pasitos or if you're uh, doing some of the uh, some of the daycare stuff at, at mm-hmm. uh, Little Steps. All of that, um, you're making a difference here and mm-hmm. helping out. So, uh, again, trytobosa.org is the website. Um, is there a, uh, I guess, for if you have questions about Los Pasitos and you, you like to do the phone thing, what's probably the best number to call for that? Um, and, uh, and is it the same as Little Steps or is it no. a different number? Okay. Uh, Little Steps is uh, 575-623-6402. Okay. And, um, again, my name is Marisa, and uh, Angelique is also the administrative assistant, so she can help parents walk through all that. Very good. Absolutely. And uh, do you know the Los Pasitos number, or we're going to have to? I have it. Okay. (laughs) See? I, uh, I, I... I was hoping, Mike, you'd have, a, you'd have it on. I, well, I have a number, but I'm not sure which number it is. Right. It's 623-0849. That's but it. Is that the Los Pasitos number? Okay. That is it. I just said call that number, but I wasn't yeah. sure which way that would get that you. So, so the Los Pasitos number is 575-623-0849. Yes. And again, the Carnival Stepping Out for Children Carnival happening this Saturday, 9 a.m. to noon at the Tobosa Children's Campus, which is at 110 East Summit. Mm-hmm. Uh, you can put that in your GPS or, or just head on over if you been by it a thousand times Mm -hmm. come out bring the whole family free food fun games the whole nine learn more also about little steps los pasitos all that really tobosa does and uh and of course just come out have some fun it's free don't need to bring anything other than yourselves and the family and uh, come out and ready to have some fun Mm -hmm. so good deal well thank you ladies appreciate it and uh we will talk to you again soon i'm sure all right take care And have fun. Thank now, you. Give, give Marisa. She's going to go record her first ad now. So <laughs> she's nervous, but she'll be just fine. She'll be so, just fine. So just if Sean gets too lippy in there, just punch him. He's okay. right. He can take it. He's a big, strong <laughs> so I'm just kidding. <laughs> you tell people to hit me. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. I appreciate Thank it. Thank you. It is uh, 